Are you excited about it? Or? Yeah, I'm, I'm saying intrigued, mixed emotions really. Okay. I'm a bit nervous, but then excited at the same time, so a bit of both. <laughs> well, I'm not that really religious anyway, but everyone looked really friendly and it looked like I'd meet a lot of new people. Um, I really wanted to do it for my God, you can as well, for the residential section. So, it looked good. I've never really done like volunteering, I'm not particularly religious, um, but I just wanted to do it because I don't feel you, you need to be religious to volunteer. And, yeah. Okay. So, why yeah. would you guys encourage someone who hasn't ever been to go to Lourdes? It's just such a, a social and inclusive place. Like, everyone's so nice, everyone's so welcoming. And it's not just like, it's not all service. You have time for yourself as well, which is also incredibly important. It's kind of a work hard, play hard culture. Um, you just gotta, it might seem a bit daunting, it might seem very unknown. Um, every year is different, so every year is a bit unknown. <laughs> um, but you've just got to take that leap. Just have the guts to do that. It's not as scary as you think it's going to be. No, like, once you once you get the swing of it, it's just it's a big family and everything. So yeah, no, you've got a lot to look forward to. Yeah. What would you be hoping that young people will have got from today about coming to Lourdes? Uh, a real sense of enthusiasm and preparedness for a great pilgrimage. Ashley, were you really dreading it? Yeah, because... Were you really? <laughs> but, yeah, because I didn't know what to expect and I just... I felt like... I just... I don't know, I don't know why, I just was really dreading it. But it's literally like not used to... I really don't want to leave now, I'm really sad. No, we don't want to leave at all. So will you come next year? Oh my yeah, god, yeah! We're coming next year. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're coming next year, aren't we, Ellen? Yeah. Cool. You sound really enthusiastic, Ellen. <laughs> Are you? Yeah. Uh, so I was very nervous about coming because I didn't know anyone, I didn't know what to expect and everything. And being out of your... It's not that I haven't been out of my comfort zone at all. Like, there's not many places you can go and sit down at a table and not feel awkward. So that's nice. Good. And Emmy, you've you come as a red shirt. Do you think you'll come back as a helper? Yes. Yes? Okay. And Levi, words of wisdom? Stay away. <laughs> oh, thanks, Levi. That's exactly the right word. It's awful. So that's why you've been coming to you. Yeah, How six years, years now. Yeah. Eight years. <laughs> <laughs> a great week, a tiring week. Yeah, really good. One. So, yeah. Fred, this is your first year as a helper, isn't it? It is, yeah. What persuaded you to come back as a helper? I generally had a really great time last year. So you came with your grandparents yeah, last yeah, year yeah. just to support them? Yeah, the care for them, yeah. So I'd never heard of it until they mentioned it. Right. And I literally had no idea about it. So I came in like no preconceptions. I was just amazed because like, I don't think there's anything else quite like it. Like, it's just so bizarre. It's my own little community. Alice, it's the end of your week. You weren't sure what to make of Lourdes. What, what would you think of it now? What's your opinion of it now? It's brilliant. Um, I've been able to fit in so well with everyone. Everyone's really friendly, really nice. Um, and no matter what, how much you believe in your faith and stuff, you're accepted no matter what. Um, it's really helped like, strengthen my faith. So. And you said at the beginning you wanted to come because of your DV really. Is that is that all you've got out of this week? No. I've got out so many friendships. So much has happened. Um, I believe in God a bit more and I definitely do um, want my faith to grow and get improved. Fantastic. Well, we'll see you next year then. <laughs> yes, definitely. Brilliant. <laughs> you've got to come to Lourdes. This is one of those places where you have to visit. Uh, it's an incredible place, a place of great healing. And I always feel like I come to know Jesus a little bit better here. Brilliant. So yeah, definitely come.